to war at all that. Suratu fula katira. Anything I touch blossoms. Zeratu. I know my purpose. <laughs> no! Housemates, you have won your wager. Week 6 Wager Task Presentation Team Like Play, Like Play. So earlier on, Big Brother gave the housemates the responsibility to create a unique superhero story that they should tap into themselves and create a unique superhero and villain story. And these characters should support evil or good. And why doing this, they should do well to relate this story to their story in Big Brother Niger House. Fast forward to today, TJ, the narrator of today's story, told us that it's all about a war at Agot. Their stage play is about a queen mother who has a son. And as time passes by, there began to happen a conflict between evil and good and at that the people of Agot we are sitting on the fence between evil and good to bring an end to this conflict between goodness and evil the queen decided to bring an end to this by summoning her sons Retuso and Votuso meanwhile the one represents good the other evil so Ozi who is Votuso stands for good while Osi, who is Retuso, stands for evil. And the queen, you know, put them to go and fight. And whoever wins will now prevail. So if evil wins against good, that means the whole people of Ogat will take evil as pattern of living and vice versa. So to go to war, the queen now summoned the people of Ogat and her two sons now have to select their armies now all they had to do was to raise their motem and to draw their armies to them those that stand for good we move to ozi while those that stand for evil we automatically be drawn to ozi so after selecting their armies retuso and votuso separated to go prepare for what is ahead of them now in the camp of goodness we have victoria who goes by the name time ports and we have Suj, whose superhero's time. name is sujad he's blessed with the gift of strength anita goes by the name lerato and her superpower is love and sacrifice handi is sarato and her superpower is to calm down anger eliminate vengeance and bring about forgiveness and the last on the camp of good we have ben who goes by the name justice he is the creator of laughter so these are the people that make up the army of goodness that is votuso's armies now let's go to retuso's army that's osis armies and remember they are the camp of evil now we have wani who goes by the name Taro. she stands for vengeance and anger then remember that her sister on the other camp stand for what bringing down anger and eliminating vengeance and we have nelly who goes by the name selisa she's the goddess of seduction and then we have cassius known for logic and smoothness and this character is played by sean kelly ray is playing the character of katos known for destroying and manipulating with his voice and finally we have concerto that's tofa who possesses the spirit of confusion and this is where the story began now concerto remember tofa is playing the character of concerto so concerto is confused stuck between evil or good and wondering what am i who am i what do i stand for and then he found himself in the bush where he met the spirit of love and sacrifice that is lerato and you know charmed by lerato's beauty was like who are you and lerato being scared that he's on the camp of evil was like hope you won't harm me and lerato said well you can't harm me and tofa laughed saying you think i can't harm you and you know you know then asked uh, lerato who are you? And Lerota came closer to him, asking him, what are you doing here? And Tofa then turned to ask Anita, do you even have any evil in you? And Lerota answered, of course, when I'm human, but the good part of me, 
outshines the evil part of me. And the Loretta coming closer said, Oh, you have some good in you too. Tofa, still confused, now decided to even go and see a seer to know what he stands for. On getting to meet the seer, meanwhile, she's about to play the character of the seer, while Cassia played the character of Amira, who is the daughter of the seer. Now, on getting here, the seer told Tofa that, Oh, she has been waiting for you, the time is finally here, and then hands a sword to Tofa and telling him oh you were made for this you know go and fight fight for where you stand and Tofa even became more confused like what was going on why are you giving me a sword I came here to discover and find out about me and you're handing me a sword so Tofa trying to inquire more but then the seer needed to rest and Amira played by Cassia now told him oh you can go you can go the queen wants to rest that's the seer wants to rest rather Tofa now, more confused, started wandering in the forest and then came to meet Lerato again, that's Anita. And he said, oh, we meet again, you know, who will help me solve this confusion in me? I don't even know what I stand for. And then Lerato held his hands and kissed him and now told him to come lay with her. Looked up in the, in the sky and told him to look at the stars, that they were all made with love. So at this point, after they've laid down, you know, showed showed um, Tofa the stars and they stood up and it now kissed Tofa, touched Tofa and Tofa transformed to the good parts. And remember that Conceto belongs to the evil camp. That's Conceto is Tofa. So now... Tofa now told Anita, oh, now I know my purpose. Now I know what I stand for. Now, Ratsuso, on finding out that the seer worked, worked against him, decided to go pay the seer a visit and manipulated Amira, that's Cassia, to buy her mother, the seer. So, Amira now buy her mama. That's uh, Cassia played the role of the daughter of uh, the seer, that's Amira. Meanwhile, after Consento transformed to to good telling uh anita that's uh, lerato oh now i know my purpose you know lerato was asking him are we not going to be fighting against each other or you know being that he has transformed no i take note of this part too the part where uh lerato transformed him just take part of take note of that now the d-day is here and both camp now have to fight so that one can prevail over another Vetuso now told his army that they should make sure that good, you know, prevails. They should make sure to win this so as they will prevail over evil. Now, time to get down and both camp tried using their superpower. Starting with Nelly, who is the goddess of seduction, tried to seduce Ben. And remember, Ben is the creator of laughter. And Ben still prevailed by making Nelly to laugh and then nearly had to follow Ben to their own camp. And Wani and Handy, who won't stand for anger and vengeance and the other is to calm down and take away anger, vengeance. And being that they were twins, you know, they were stuck in between fighting each other. But at the end of the day, uh, Handy was able to prevail over Wani. Now, by the time the camp of evil were done losing their soldiers and it was left with Retuso and Vertuso. And you know, Retuso was telling Vertuso, Oh, you can take me away, feel free to buy me. And Vertuso said, No, I stand for good, I won't do that to you. Rather, I will transform you. So, on hitting him, he then transformed to the good part. So, goodness now prevailed over evil. And now they have to pay their mom a visit as to give her a feedback from the war she sent them. Coming back to their mom and the queen was so excited, screaming, oh, good, goodness won over evil. And the people of Ogat then turned to good. Not until one day, Taro Dashos, played by Wani, now found another reason again to turn to evil or good. And now... That's where the suspense comes in because TJ, you know, had to come narrate again, telling us that the story continues. So more like we should watch out for season two, maybe part two, which one? <laughs>
well big brother then called on head of house onyeka to review their performance and onyeka then told big brother that they followed the instruction of the wager just like the wager instructed that it should be about a superhero and a villain and this was played by oz and oc that's votuso and retuso and you included that they should have sub characters and they did this you know they displayed this by each camp having their own soldiers as each person uh, the superhero having his own armies the villain having his own armies and you said we should infuse this with our story in your house and we tried creating these characters by giving them what they possess in reality like ben who played whose superpower was laughter that we all know how ben makes everybody laugh in the house nelly who is an enchantress we all know that nelly is the video vixen with the body and all that kelly ray whose superpower was his voice we know that kelly ray has the most beautiful voice he sings and for sujad that suj whose superpower was strength we know how suj can be with task up and doing and tofa who played the role of uh, confession we all know that uh, tofa has that in him and anita that played the character of love and sacrifice that they can't even deny that, that anita is full of love always willing to put others before herself and sean as well whose superpower was logic and smoothness that that's who sean is in the house well she was still trying to go on and on and big brother told her to summarize everything and she said that their presentation was unique it's a never seen story and they all did well they put in their a game everybody walked to the success of the soldier big brother said that their story have so many loopholes like the parts where concerto after being transformed to good still went to uh to battle with to battle with uh the goodness that he fought against the good part so why fight against the people you've been transformed to be like you get and he also mentioned the part of the seer asking them wasn't the seer supposed to see that retuso was coming to buy her buy her why did she see that being that she's a seer and why of all solution why did the queen mother choose for her two sons to go and fight knowing it can even bring to an end of you know they can lose their life in the process but biggie said however that if he can believe all those superhero stories why can't he believe their own if he can believe in batman and all that superhero stories we all know why can't we believe in this one well big brother also went ahead to commend tj telling him that his narration to the story brought life to their presentation big brother also called on oc oz and onyeka and called them the triple o telling them that their sleepless nights to see that the wager comes to fulfillment is encouraged and commended and he also commended the part they had to use juju in their story you know that it's it's a good infusion and with that the housemates won this week's wager and remember that they wagered 100 percent like come on 100 <laughs> percent there will be enough enjoyment next week congratulations to the housemates and kudos to onyeka we who we all saw how she stayed up developed roots and created all characters in the story and to oc and oz who were there with her as well well done to them at some point today when she was still telling the various characters what they will be saying i was just like i'm pretty sure these people will win this wager because as of 3 p.m onyeka was still telling them things to say uh, you know when acting and i remember at some point cassia was it cassia anita was even laughing like uh -uh, do we now have another thing to add you know it was just all fun and joke but seeing them put off that wonderful performance honestly i would say this girl knows her onions because she delivered she over delivered we can say she's the writer producer director everything of this week's wager and well done to the housemates as well for cooperating even when there was no script she was just telling them things to do and it all came out beautiful congratulations to onyeka and the housemates 
thank you for watching thank you for listening i will see you in my next video and i would like to read your comments regarding the various characters and loopholes what do you think generally about their storyline their performance and everything in between and if you enjoy listening to this long narration boring narration please do well to tell me in the comment section like this video share comments and good night